Hey Steven, it's Tammy. Thank you so much for taking the time to watch this video. So I just wanted to give you some tips and tricks on um how you can optimize your Facebook page a little bit. So, and honestly, you're probably wondering why I'm doing this, but honestly, I believe that givers gain. So I hope this um, helps you out. What I would do here is I would put your hours that you work that would help optimize it. I would put your location, um, Indianapolis in here. And the main thing is I would save your pictures as um, keyword, so something relevant to your line of work. So instead of download, you want to save those um, whatever city like Indianapolis or other cities that you serve. You could do seating, Indianapolis, um, um, tree health, Indianapolis. Those are some good spring and fall cleanup, Indianapolis. For all these different things that you do, save um, as Indianapolis or the specific city. And that way, Google can take notice of you better and what you do. And so when somebody is searching for those services, you could pop up on um, the first page of Google. Now I'm just going to go over briefly um, how having a website could bring you increased income. So I chose green image landscape and design just for a possible competitor. Um, as marketers, we like to have about 1500 words on the home page. That way you can stuff in more content and more organic keywords and really get yourself to rank. So here we're just looking at a paid tool that I use called Arifs and I plug them in up here at the top. Um, so definitely having um, more content, you can stuff in more organic keywords. So I will try to find you some more keywords that you can use. So this is a search volume per month in the keywords. Um, so let's see. 800 people per month are searching green image. So if you saved one of your pictures as that, instead of um, just download, you could potentially be getting 800 people searching for you. 250 people per month are searching perennial flowers, Indiana. 900 people per month are searching trim trees. So if you do have a website and you do have um, quite a bit of content within there, then you are able to stuff in more organic keywords and really get yourself to rank. So here you can see they get about 108 people per month. Um, so having a website is an investment, but it does pay back very quickly. Um, the second thing I wanted to talk about with having a website is backlinks. So a backlink is a link that has a web it's another website that has a link to your website and that link to your website could potentially be bringing you more traffic but it's really important to keep in mind that not all backlinks are created equal so you're going to get a lot more power and trust from google if you have other landscaping companies linking to you versus pizza hut because the internet knows you're not a pizza company um so definitely getting um relevant backlinks would definitely help you out um it's kind of like a popularity contest with Google. Whoever has the most, back, not even the most backlinks, but the most relevant backlinks um, gets to the top page of the search bar. And then the third thing is citation. So you want to get your business name, address, and phone number listed in various directories as well, like Yelp and Yellow Pages. You're doing great with uh, Facebook uh, as a good start. You, it looks like you have 75 followers. Mm -hmm. So if you are interested in um, scaling up a little bit, feel free to reach out and I can do more digging and get more information for you and see what could be a realistic goal for your business. I hope this video was helpful. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.